You got a problem? My name is Sabir. And what is that supposed to mean to me? I'm your brother in this, uh, You're not my brother. I'm your brother in humanity. You're not my brother. No. You're, are, you, are you a Muslim? I'm a Muslim. How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Uh, around the same age that Mary was. Where does it say Mary had an age? Uh, Catholic encyclopedia. No, well, we're not yes. Catholics. We're Christians. Yeah. They're, they're, Catholics they're, believe in purgatory. Christianity don't. You don't know the difference? They are also if you want to demons. argue about Christianity and you don't know the difference between Catholicism, buddy, you're about as wacko as it gets. So I came here and we came here just to look at our friends, what we are doing. You're, you're not our friend. Your religion is killing people right now as you and I are talking. So don't tell me you're Islam, friends. Islam is perfect just because some people are doing wrong things. Some Christians, Muslims, Jews, we don't blame the ideology, we blame those people. No, you don't. Yes. I don't see you in the streets protesting when, you're, when your religion is yes, killing people. Yes, As don't. a matter of fact, your religion will kill no, you no, before no. it kills me. Well, Islam says that we are taking one innocent life according to Islam, chapter 5, verse number 32 of the Quran. Yeah, brother, why are you it's like, to hang on. It's like, it's like why taking you, you the, don't know anything? Are you saying he's doing such a bad job? You're trying to you're trying to bail him out. So, see, he's thinking you're doing such a bad job. He wants to bail you out. It is my you're supposed to be, you know, taking care of our No. So, so, so the Quran says, chapter five, verse forty-two, taking one innocent life is like taking the life of all of humanity and saving one life, my friend. But when you like kill, they're not them. innocent. In the context when you of when your religion kills. It is because you believe they're not innocent. No, do, no, do you no. live in New, uh, Washington, D.C.? No, I'm from Chicago. Okay, so did you fly into the uh, uh, airport? I did not. Did you, did you fly into the airport? Driving here. Okay. If you've flown into the airport, we have a lot of security that we didn't have before. Why? Why do we have all this security? So Your here religion. To, I'm here to share Islam with you because there are so many things Common, on the no, I want to make sure everybody understands your religion and Christianity is not the same. And if you yes. want to put Christianity and Catholicism, Jesus, you don't know love. what you. As a son of God, Mary, Mary we love. as a son no, of God, he's not son of God, as a son of God, he's a he's a, on, a normal people. Do you have anything ticking on you, pal? Do you have anything ticking on you? What, what do you have in that black bag? Let me check it out. Do you have anything ticking on you? What do you want to walk away? You got a bad attitude. I don't trust you. Okay. So, you know, Jesus is Jesus is the son yeah. of God? So Jesus is mentioned with honor and respect and love in the Quran 25 times. You know, Mary is the only lady who's mentioned in the entire How Quran old was Quran. Mary? It doesn't mention her age. And you never my original question to you when you came up and you kind of went away, how old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Quran does not say that. I'm not asking the Quran. We have a book called the Hadith. Yeah, and in the Hadith, it tells you a lot more information. But the Quran is the primary source, by the way. And that but is the Hadith tells mentioned. you to pray, bathe. It tells you other principal things. So according to the Hadith, how old was Aisha? Back in those days, Mary, Give me a number. Mary and Aisha and almost all the Jewish, the Christian, the Muslim ladies 2,000 years ago, they used to get married once they reached the age of puberty. Okay, even in this country, 200, 300 years ago, the documented cases in Alabama and Kentucky and New York and Seattle, when as young as 7, 9, 10, 11 years old, girls married in I'm not country. asking about Kentucky. So what I'm, I'm asking is, about Aisha, and you don't want to answer the question. Scholars differ on it, but whatever her age is not... Okay, suppose if I say she's 19 or 9 or 29 or 69... How about 6? That's, that's not a deciding factor for who's going to go to paradise or hellfire. What is the deciding factor, my friend, is are we worshiping the right creator the way Jesus, Moses, Abraham used to worship? No. But let's look at the character no. of your prophet. Yeah, when, Aisha, when Aisha said she's having sex and she had a stuffed animal there, Obviously, that should tell you she was a very young woman. He was the best of character. If you look into the Quran, the Quran says in chat uh, that he is the blessing for humanity. Gandhi, when he read the biography of Muhammad, peace be upon him. And, See that little uh, girl there? And, and, a and, Muslim and, can marry that and, little girl and, today. And, and, and many oh, that's, that's wicked. Uh, and many, I'm right here. You got something to say? Come down and say it to me. Why would you bring a daughter that age to a, to a wicked place like this? Sir, sir. 
Why would you bring a daughter that age? I mean, that's what you're profit. A 50-year-old man looking at a girl like that and saying, that's marriage material, that's wrong. Let us study the act. What, what counts on the Day of Judgment is, are we having the right concept of God that Abraham used to have? He only used to worship the Creator, not Trinity, not any son or daughter, no father, mother, uncle, absolute oneness, Moses and Jesus. You know, Jesus also said, by the way, in the Quran, chapter 3, verse 51, Inna Allah Rabbi wa Rabbukum fa'abudu haza sirata mustaqim. The translation is, Verily, God is my God, Allah, and your God. Worship Him alone. That is the right path. You know, this this Moses, is what's unique about the Bible. Mormons, the Book of Mormon, takes verses out of this into their book. The Quran, so it can be legitimate, pulls verses out of the Bible. Quran the Bible is like the Word of God. Okay, how about like this? Mark chapter 12. The Gospel of Mark chapter 12, verse number 28. A Jewish person came to Jesus and asked him this question, million dollar question. Of all the commandments, which one is the first, the greatest, all of them? Jesus he replied in verse number 29 of Mark. Hear, O Israel, the Lord, our God, is only one. Worship Him with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. And that is the first commandment. He was and talking we, to the Jewish and, people. And we Muslims say oh, that God is only one. He's a bastard religion. Oh, you're a bastard religion. Okay, so you didn't come from the we, vine of Israel. We worship the same creator that Abraham, Moses, and especially Jesus and Muhammad, peace be upon him, used to worship. No. No argument here. Muhammad okay. is a lie. No, no, no argument here. Muhammad is a lie. We are here just to convey the wonderful faith of Jesus. And your Who religion is chopping heads off and Jesus. burning churches right now. Jesus you want to come here and tell me you're normal and everything's nice? It's a lie. Be honest. At I, least I would have you. more respect with you if you would have said, you know what? You're right. right. Okay. You and I are talking and they're burning churches right now in Iraq, you know Kuwait, Muslim. Saudi Arabia. Okay. okay, fine. I take what you're saying, right? Some Muslims are doing wrong things. Some Christians are doing wrong things. Some Jews are doing wrong things. That's a human problem. What 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 are Christianity doing? Oh, all you, you know, you're asking. I'm sorry. I'm, I, I, Go I'm ahead. standing here. Look at the I've, I've, I've been standing here for the last ten minutes. Go ahead. No, I'm going to speak. You're going to look at me because you have respect uh, no, me. You're well. next, woman. You don't want. I'm no, not your husband. If you are, if no, you are, where, the, where, so what's the difference if you between Christianity? If you represent Christianity, what's the difference? If you between represent Christianity, this is why represent, women are are silencing your religion, you, right? No, this is exactly why women just recently learned to drive a car and so. But you're not the one who's letting me talk. Because you're. Not letting this is the talk. reason why. But you're not this letting me talk. Why. But you're not letting you me talk. Interrupt. But you're you not letting me talk. He's letting me talk. Show me the No, no, I have a question. Because I like to. You mentioned Catholicism. He's unbelievable. She could be your sister. She's not my sister. Hello, look at me. 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 Look at I came, I came out here to, to meet my brothers. I you know, we're not brothers. I'm Let's like make that very clear. Why is no, that? Our, our Quran says in chapter 49, verse number 13, right? Chapter, once, you know my brother. Cha chapter. See, he at least admits that. He at least. You have to I would have more respect for him. I would have more respect for him. He's one of your own, and he's willing to say, even though he's an idiot for bringing a daughter in a place like this. You have to be a human. Knowing first. you're going to actually marry you have, you have to your be, prophet, you married have, something like you this. You have to be a human first to be called a brother. You're not even I, a human. I take you as my brother. You're a hate monger. Because the Quran says, Quran is a book of unity. The Quran says in chapter 49. Unity is here. Killing people. Come on. Chapter chapter 49, verse number 13 says, wow. God is speaking. Wow. And God is saying, you know, all mankind, all humanity, I have made you from one single male and one single female and made you into nations and peoples and tribes. That you get to know each other. Not that you may hate and despise each other. You get to know each other. And, the, and then the, 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 your, as your and then the God says, people. and then God says, and the best amongst you is the one who is a well-mannered person. Okay? Your religion it's came religion, from a whore. It's, it's not your the religion people. didn't come from Abraham. So that's my job to invite you to worship the one creator of Abraham. You're going to let me inside? Hmm? You're going to let me inside? I'm not the organizer, by the way. Oh, well, why not? Since you're so welcoming, why don't they let me inside? Why don't they let me be a speaker inside? I'm 
not an organizer, but I can say But if that you're all that, why not do it? Let us as brothers in humanity, let's worship the one creator so we can establish societies based upon morality, uh, unity. Morality uh, as you're killing people right now? Come on. Spirituality. Come on. And peace and justice for all. And if we do that, inshallah, God willing, we will get the best in the hereafter. That's all my message of peace, my dear brother. You, you don't, Thank you your message of peace yeah. is chopping Thank heads you. off. Let's be very honest. Let's be very honest. All the security we have at all the airports, so so, your so religion. That's all, so that's all I have to say. And, and you never came peace. up with an age for Aisha. What's your you. What's your interpretation? Give me a number. Oh, was she eight? Was she twenty? You. I'm asking you, not a scholar. How old was Aisha? You. Let me ask you, do you believe in Jesus? Just a second, Would let Jesus approve your behavior? Absolutely, today? pal. I don't think Absolutely. So. I don't think so. Well, Jesus that's why you don't know that Jesus is the right Son of God. Now. Just give me a number. Jesus said to love your enemy, even if you take us not I got it. I understand that. But so, you, you know, keep sidestepping the question. I'm asking you, not a scholar, not him. I'm not asking his opinion. You. Okay, fine. How old was Aisha? Can I give you a three minute uh, No. I will what are you, a no. politician? Just no, give no. me an answer. I, you I told me Mary, that. I'm telling you, nowhere in the Bible does okay. it say so. You can use Catholicism. Okay, can I speak? Number, just give me a number. No. I will give you in the context the number, okay? So this is the context. First and foremost, the Quran is silent about age. There are multiple hadiths. Hadith, this is my, this is my where I'm going, not the, yeah, not, not, course, not the okay. Quran. Okay. If I talk to a Mormon, sometimes it's not written in the Book of Mormon. Sure, it's sure. in the Pearl of Great Price, it's others. So can I, can I speak, and in the context I will speak, okay. It will be a cultural fallacy if we judge other cultures based upon our 21st century ethnocentric American culture, number one. Number two would be, if we travel back 2,000 years ago, 3,000 years ago in the time of Moses, Jesus, or Muhammad peace be upon them, girls used to get married, it was acceptable right after they reached the age of puberty. The Jewish used to do it, the Christians... I'm not talking no, Jews, no, no. just give me a straight okay. answer. So in that context, Don't try to justify it because you know it's going to be wrong. Just give me a straight answer. He's giving you a straight answer. Coming, you a straight answer. Brother, Keep your mind open, ears open. Here's open. Okay. He is giving you a straight answer. Hang on. I am giving, I'm hanging on. Okay. I'm giving the proper context. Okay. It was acceptable for anyone yeah. reaching the age of puberty to get married. Now, according to the Hadith, she reached the age of puberty. The marriage was con consummated when she was nine, according to some narrations. Nine. Some narrations, they say something otherwise. Okay. So there's a conflict. I didn't ask for commentary. Uh, I asked for okay. you. Number four. You. Sure, sure. So number four is that if the marriage was wrong for that time and that age in that culture, how come there was not an uproar from the Muslims, from any one of the wives, or from Aisha, peace be upon her, or from Islamophobes of that time? They all accepted the marriage. So the marriage was 100% accepted. Number four, right? And number five is this. Number five is this. She became one of the greatest scholars of Islam. About peace and unity, about how to pray. How she to talks about God. being beaten by no. by Mohammed. Not, no, not a single time. No, come on, no. you're, you're not being very honest. And and again, so why peace, can't so you just give point. an answer? I did. Oh, so you're saying? I did. You're saying uh, seven, eight yeah. years old? No, I didn't say yeah. seven, eight. I said yeah. she was nine, according to one set of narrations, when the marriage was consummated. So, and so this was, this he married her age. younger than nine, but had yeah. intercourse at age God. nine. After she reached the age of puberty, people at that time in those cultures, even in the 20, even in 200 years ago, in our country, our founding fathers they approved those marriages. If you're lady, not a nine-year-old, but I don't know where you get your history from. Delaware and Alabama and Kentucky and in uh, and, and in Seattle, it's still no. wrong. Okay, According just because According the Bible. The Bible, Bible, that, that, Bible that's, that's not, a child. Bible does not have that's a, a child. Bible does not have a minimum age for marriage. Show me one place. According to that's Bible, a child. Jesus doesn't say no. he's God, by the way. Uh, yes. Do you worship Jesus? Do you only worship God? I only you worship got, God. You got verses where Jesus was worshipped there. I don't worship a mortal man. You got Jesus being worshipped and he never corrected you. Bible, Jesus you got four times where Jesus was worshipped. How are you going to handle that? That's an example. That's not a verse. Okay, fine. So let us now come to theology, okay, my dear friend. Okay, first and foremost, the most important thing for me when I stand in front of God is, did I worship the right God, the right concept of God? Right? You that failed. 
we worship a creator who is eternal, does not, was not born. Mormons say the same thing. Okay, number two. Catholics say the same thing. Number two, God, according to Islam, according to the Quran, is not a triune God. Jesus never came to say, I am God and worship me. Jesus said that when his disciples came to ask him this question, right? In Matthew chapter 6, verse number 9, who do we worship and how do we worship? You can look this up. Jesus pointed to the heaven and he said, worship that entity. And he said, then the lost prayer. If he were God, he would have said, you know, I am God worship. Thomas worshiped Jesus after no, Jesus no, rose from the dead. No, he did not. It's in the Bible. I saw Thomas worshiped. No, That's not. one of many people. No, and Jesus didn't say, Thomas, get up. What are you doing worshiping me? I did lectures on the So now you're going to quote. Now you're going to. Now the Bible's wrong. Yes. But yet you want to quote. You want to use this same book in the Quran, and you want to say it's wrong. A single word. A double standard. Double standard. That book is unreliable. How can you quote anything from that book? Jesus himself worshipped God. So are you saying there are two gods? Who was Jesus worshipping? There's three. There's three that all make the one God. It's called the Godhead. It's uh, like First John. First John teaches that there are three that bear record in heaven: the Father, the Word, the Holy Ghost. These three are one. But First That's... John, First John one seven has been taken out. It's a plagiary within the Bible. King James have it, NIV does not, RSV does not. By the way, so how many Bibles do you have? You have, you have many. many. Even if you remove that, you no. have many verses. Jesus said, "Me verse. and my Father, I and my Father are one." In what Why context? God He's one. Three God 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 He's Why one. Why did He after He said, "Me and my disciples He's are one"? One, one second, okay. In John chapter 10, verse number 29, Jesus said, My Father is greater than I. That means, Father is greater than Jesus. In John chapter 14, verse number 28, Jesus said, My Father is greater than I. That means, Father is greater than Jesus. And in John chapter 30, then Jesus said, Me and my Father are one in the context of same purpose, not the same person. You can't even believe in Jesus as the Son of God. So you're going to have difference. And in the Bible is wrong. No. You believe like this guy. They At are. least he was honest. My, my dear this Muslim, who I wouldn't trust, David? even babysit an ant, uh, I would at least uh, uh, appreciate him because he's at least saying the Bible David, is wrong. David is mentioned in Psalm chapter 2, verse number 7, as the begotten son of God. So, the, so according to the Bible, according to the Old Testament times, according to the Eden's Bible Dictionary, if you look at the Son of God category, it says anyone who is righteous is called as the Son of God. So Son of God is a metaphorical term. It's not a literal There's term. a difference between a capital S there is no capital and in a Hebrew. small there S. There is no capital in That's Hebrew. That's the concept about the King James Bible. There is no it's concept. It's unique in that regard, Greek, which you wish to discard. Greek, Arabic, Hebrew, they don't have capital letters. And when you have examples of Jesus Christ being worshipped, you have to display either it's a false Bible like this guy says okay. or it's true and Jesus would have corrected the guy and say don't worship me get up Thomas he actually been worshipped with people that had a healing they came and they worshipped that's what the Bible okay. says according they worshipped him according to the according to the strong concordance of the Bible the worship the word worship is a Greek word that is prokunios prokunios was done by the angels uh, to humans it was done by the your, your it's worship. No, it's it's not. worship. That's a wrong translation, my dear friend. So then the Bible is there. The King James Version, the translation is wrong. Because, oh, it's because, wrong. Because according, to, according So then why would you take verses out of the Bible and apply them into the not. Quran? Yes, you're just like the Mormons. The Mormons say, no, no, that's not true. But yet they're going to pull verses out of this same Bible and put it into their holy book. The Quran was given independently by the Creator. And Jesus was given certain revelation. Just because they are matching verses, they have the same source. Later on, Bible was uh, altered and edited and revised. But the Quran remained pure. So for that reason, you see some overlapping words. Not because Bible... New Testament was copied into the Quran, but because they have the same source. Worshipping the same Creator who created all of us. We may differ in the definition, but what we Muslims say is the Creator, Sustainer, Eternal. He is a forgiving, merciful, powerful, loving Creator, right? Number gotcha. one. Number two is that God, by His loving and guiding nature, He appointed prophets and messengers to help us. So we are not lost. So he appointed uh, Moses and Abraham and Solomon and David and Moses and Jesus and Muhammad. Peace be upon them. So he gave them revelation that invites your people to worship only one God, not to worship creation. 
humans and animals and creation but she only one god right point number two point number three is that god sent many revelations like a study guide when you went to school like a study guide and many revelations were given moses jesus abraham david were given revelation some of them got changed so god sent his final book the quran to muhammad peace be upon him and he took the guarantee of preserving it so the quran that we have is exactly the same one that was given to muhammad peace be upon him it has solutions for humanity's problems you know discord that we have this unity drug problem gambling breakdown of the family the structure suicide homicide drugs gambling quran has solutions along with the hadith and the sunnah of muhammad peace be upon him right that's number 3 and the last point is this just like when we work somewhere there's always a criteria and assignment that we need to complete so we can get a check from our boss when we go to school we need to complete certain assignment certain policies of the school teacher so we can get a good grade in the same way god said in the quran chapter 2 verse number 25 that anyone who has the right belief and doing good deeds god will guarantee those people eternal paradise so i hope and pray my dear brother in humanity and all my brothers up there that we only worship the creator of abraham and all of us that we do good deed as was done as was revealed in the quran your deeds so, are not going to get you so there so in that way we can step, so we can stop no god says by the mercy of god eventually a person goes so what deeds do and what believe does they they will have god fulfill god will look at that as a criteria to send his mercy mercy itself would be the final deciding factor And, and you you've escaped the mercy of God by rejecting Jesus as the son of God. Everything that you said but but you accept the four every, important points. Everything that you said a Catholic has told me. Everything that you said a Mormon has told not me. Not about the Quran, not about Muhammad. No, they they got their own books. Yeah, but they got their own books. Read the Quran. If you don't have the Quran, I can run up there, I can give a copy free of charge to each single one of you. Bring them up. Right? I'll I'll yeah. uh, Can you bring five copies? Up. Just yeah. one thing because so, uh, I'm leaving. So he my friend is getting five copies of the Quran. Bring them up. Yeah, in English translation and the only thing But for, you know what? If I read it and I find an error I'm going to talk to somebody just like you and you know what you're going to say it's not the original language it's no, no. been it's been so, watered down in ink one second and leave you right? you know that's what's going to happen if I show you you're going to say well that's not what the original it's the english language see that's what's different about the bible when god translated in english it's perfect so that's so that it's Perfect. God did never translate it in English because Jesus. Oh, was he playing golf no, no, that no, day? No, Come no, on! No, you cannot say that. So, uh, let me first. I, 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 I know he's I, I, leaving, I'm so I'm just give him a couple of minutes. Sorry, I'll okay. spend some extra time with yeah, you. Yeah. I know some of them need more time. So, so my brothers are going to give you a copy of the Quran. Only request is respect it and just read with read with a sincere heart, open mind. Oh God, please guide me wherever the truth is. And my job is not to convert you. By the way, only God can. All I can do I, is it wouldn't happen. Yeah. All, all Once I, I can, taste of the Jesus Christ, I will never go after all, anybody else. All, all I can do is I care about you. I care about humanity. And my.